Hi everybody, Dave Sullivan here for The Credit Guy TV. This time I want to talk about an article in the National Professional Mortgage Magazine uh, written by Chad called The Credit Conundrum. And in this article he states that the credit agencies have little incentive to correct errors on their credit report because the credit agencies profit from the errors. And that's just not correct. And let me explain this to you. So the repositories gather the information from creditors of mortgage, your auto loan, all, all your visa, your Home Depot card. They gather all the information, but they don't create your credit report. They only create it when somebody requests the information. Now, provided that the requester enters the information accurately, you will, that uh, request is searched all the databases, they pull back the credit information and provide it to you. There is no financial incentive for them to have errors on that at that point because they make their money when they sell the information. So when they sell the information, they get paid. Whether it's accurate or not, really, at that point, doesn't make any difference because they've already been paid. But the Fair Credit Reporting Act requires that they make their best efforts to make sure that the information is accurate. And they've actually been sued over this for millions and millions of dollars, so they have a financial incentive to try and make sure that all this information is accurate. Now, they can't control what's being reported to them, and that's where most of the errors come in, is the, the information is reported to the credit repository incorrectly from the creditor. Well, the consumer can for free go on and dispute these things online and get them resolved that way, and there's no cost to the individual. Now, that does cost the repository to investigate, but it's far better for them to investigate the errors and correct them than to leave them and get sued later because of the Fair Credit Reporting Act. There's really no financial incentive for them to provide a report with errors. None. Now, I can also tell you that while the credit repositories don't do everything perfectly, they provide a lot of good to society because right now, 90% of the people watching this video can go out to any Home Depot and walk out with $5,000 in material with a signature. And nowhere else in the world where they don't have a credit database can you do that. It's a huge benefit for society, for mortgages, for auto loans. You can walk in and on a signature leave with thousands of dollars in merchandise or a car or anything because we have the credit repositories. It's really the envy of the world, our system. We have three major repositories here. Nowhere else in the world do they have all three of them. So they provide a lot of good, but I don't agree with everything they do, but still, it's a huge benefit to society. It does no good to demonize them, um, and especially when this uh, opinion comes from somebody who's engaged in charging people to correct things on their credit report. I totally disagree with it. That's my take on it. If you have comments, please post them down below. So that's Dave Sullivan for The Credit Guy TV. So you, with a little bit of me, we're going to change the credit industry. Thank you.